These two mayors have made it quite clear from the beginning that they're going to work together. You know, Manchester and Liverpool rivalry down the years has been notorious, but these two mayors made it quite clear right from the start that they were going to work together, and I think we've seen that in the meeting that we've had today. We were the sponsors here today um, for this event and this is really important to us. We're a business that's growing and expanding all over the country and we've just appointed somebody here to Manchester so to see what's going on and how the cities connect our head office is Liverpool. But I thought today was excellent. It touched on all of the things that are important to us, transport, skills, you know, some of the infrastructures that we all need to be getting behind. So fantastic event today. Issue, isn't it? It and, is, yes, and Francis's organisation has actually had someone who was homeless who they employed and supported and that turned that new life around. But for me and in our business, we're a bit frightened. We want to help, but we're a bit frightened of taking a homeless person on. Do we have the, you know, the, the things and structure to support that person and make sure that they succeed? Because you don't want to set somebody up to fail. So I think it is important that there are things there to support us as businesses in being able to support and empower the homeless. I think the most interesting issues that were touched on today were really about people and it was about young people and the skills agenda and the fact that we do have a skills gap that is potentially going to worsen once we go through the Brexit process. And so what we're going to do to address that and you know, both Andy and Steve were talking about more developed powers for apprenticeships, more say from local areas on education and training. And I think they're absolutely right. You know, for years we've been doing the same thing and of course getting the same results which haven't been particularly positive.